Same time, a looming verdict in Hunter Biden's felony gun trial is putting even more pressure on the Biden campaign. The first full day of jury deliberations already underway right now. And Mark Boyle is following all the latest from the live desk for us. Good morning to you. Good morning. Right now, the fate of the president's son, Jan, rests in the hands of 12 jurors. Deliberations are underway in Hunter Biden's gun trial in Delaware. That group of a dozen people are deciding if the president's son is guilty of three charges, all connected to his purchase of the gun back in 2018, which prosecutors say violated federal law because he was addicted to crack cocaine at the time. During the trial, the defense focused on um, earlier if Biden purchased that weapon, arguing that he had no direct evidence to using drugs then. On the other hand, however, prosecutors citing witness testimony, text messages, and other evidence, they said the addiction was well documented and that Hunter knew he was an addict. He has pleaded not guilty. If convicted of three counts, Hunter Biden could face up to 25 years in prison. However, experts say this is not likely. The reason this would be a first-time offender situation. A live look now over the White House. The president previously said he would accept the, the outcome of his son's trial and he would not pardon him if found guilty. If there is a decision this morning, of course, we'll let you know right here in the live desk or online.